workflow is more practical adapter. He can directly generate a multi-perspective rendering for a product image. This is very practical for making airplanes. Basically, just a little bit of processing will do. You can quickly generate an aircraft draft product picture from different angles. I will explain how to use it in detail later. Let's go through it briefly first. He can also automatically cut out other images. Same thing, switch to multiple views. Here you can add prompt words. Let him be more accurate. The effect he produces is basically perfect. Understand the content of this picture. These details are enough anyway. The details are perfect. So this is very convenient to convert all the images we need to multiple views with one click. The results are already very practical. This is a generative workflow. Exactly the same. Use prompt words to directly generate multiple views of a product or multiple views of a content. The most commonly used one should be this. Upload reference images to generate multiple views. This is more practical. I will introduce it in detail later. Okay, let me introduce I'm you first. I'm using the end-to-end -end cloud image. People don't want to deploy and install locally. If you want to use it directly online, just click on my mirror. I'm using an online mirror. You can see now what I can use. You can also use. Ready to use. The model is already deployed without any installation. Then there's not only this workflow. This is just this one. A workflow for generating multiple views from one image using Mavapter. Below are all my latest Flux models. Some raw images of the SDA 3.5 model. Anyway, all my workflows correspond to this image one by one. Then here is the generated video of the video class. Some workflows of video processing, they are all quite practical. And here is the sound generation or voice generation. Some voice editing workflows. If you wanted to put it locally, you can open my notes, click on Config with Tutorial. We'll jump to the workflow location. This is exactly the same as my mirror image. Click on the first one to see the latest MV adapter. Generate multiple views from one image. Click to download and install the node inside. And we'll close. Introduction with screenshots and workflow download. This is the local deployment. All the models and nodes I use are here. These are all the nodes I use. So just check here what knowledge you want to use. It is more convenient to check here. You don't have to look for the model in the image. Check out this detailed information here. As long as I have installed it on the image, it will be stored here. This makes it easier to find and use. OK, back. Inside Comfy UI. I deleted this one here. This is to put some ordinary images. Then automatically cut out the image and convert it into multiple views. This is not usually used. Mainly used for multi-view generation of products. The first workflow is Vincent MultiView. No reference image upload required. Just edit the prompt word here. Positive and negative prompt words. It currently only supports 768 by 768. Have a note here. It only supports 768 by 768. Sometimes an error occurs when running. I have a note Just here. refresh the page and it will return to normal. Then this is Vincent's picture. This disable. The following is to upload the reference image to generate multiple views.
This is more practical. Here are some of his models and his notes. Below is an automatic cutout. A note. This will automatically cut out this picture. Then generate multiple views. If you want to be more precise and generate multiple views, then you need to read the prompt in more detail. This one also only supports 768x768. You can set more or less. Because this also requires drawing cards. Sometimes when he generates it, there will be misunderstandings like this. You may generate it several times, but the effect achieved now is very accurate and perfect. It is enough to generate multiple views for products. Okay, let's go play.